Ce flow, past the rotating circular cylinder, results in a transverse thrust, is a lift force, acting in a direction perpendicular to the upstream flow direction. The effect of the cylinder rotation on associated circulation is to increase the velocity on one side of the cylinder and to decrease it on the other. In turn, the Bernoulli equation implies that the pressure next to the lower and upper walls must be respectively lower and greater than the static pressure. This thrust is referred to as the Magnus effect. A practical application is the rotor ship, which use rotating cylinder as sail. Designed by Anton Flettner, the first rotor ship used the Magnus effect as a main propulsion technique. The Buco sailing ship was redesigned by mounting two large vertical cylinders on the ship and then mechanically rotating the cylinder to provide circulation, hence ship propulsion. The ship, renamed Baden-Baden, successfully crossed the Atlantic Ocean. Anton Flettner was a German engineer. He consulted in particular Ludwig Prandtl on the Institute of Aerodynamics in Göttingen during the development of his rotor ship. Ludwig Prandtl wrote about the test, his uh, number of tests, and this photograph illustrated himself and his research assistant with a model of the rotor ship. More recently, a similar system was developed for the ship Alcyon of Jacques-Yves Cousteau. The propulsion system was developed by the French academic Lucien Malavar. It consists of two identical masts equipped with a boundary suction system. Indeed, the flow around the cylindrical body with circulation, the stable sail of the Alcyon ship, is a related form of the Magnus effect. Boundary suction is generated on one side of the cylinder by a suction fan in installed inside the mast while the flap controls the flow separation downstream. The resulting effect is basically equivalent to the Magnus effect and generates a significant lift force. Lucien Malava was a professor in fluid mechanics at the University of Paris, Pierre and Marie Curie, and a member of the French Academy des Sciences. Note that the key difference between the Alcyon ship and the Flettner rotor ship is a fixed mast in the Alcyon ship. The efficiency of both systems is very close. In 1926, a cargo ship was equipped with three rotors. The ship was used for six years, mostly in the Mediterranean Sea, demonstrating the functionality and reliability of the rotors. Under before four to six winds, the rotors propelled the ship at six knots. On over a six months testing period, the rotor separated for about 30 to 40 percent of the trip durations and increased the top speed by about two to three knots. In very recent years, rotors were installed in cargo ships as auxiliary power to reduce fuel consumption. The Magnus effect is a classical application of ideal fluid flow theory applied to the flow around a rotating cylinder. Its application, including the Flettner rotor ship, remain fascinating more than 170 years after its initial, initial discovery.